Hello and welcome everybody to the latest episode of the SEO Office Hours. Today's question comes from Jay, who's asking, how to change Google Search from an old domain to a new domain? All right, Jay, so what you're trying to do or what you want to do is a site migration or a site move. Uh, we have a lot of documentation on how to do that on developers.google.com slash search. If you look around that documentation, you find like guides that help you set that up. But fundamentally, you need to understand that it will take time for Google to remove the old stuff and ramp up the other stuff. So there will be like some transition period. And how smooth that is and how much that overlaps uh, depends on how well you execute it and how careful you are. Um, if you want to move from an old domain to a new domain and then restructure your whole domain and rewrite all the content, that is high risk because you are changing a lot of stuff, basically like destroying the old website and building up a new one. Um, that is really, really hard to maintain nicely. Uh, I would recommend to start setting up redirects from the old domain to the new domain and kind of like keeping the structure, keeping the content. Making sure nothing gets lost is very important there. There's tools that help you to make sure that everything from the old site got redirected to the right place in the new site, and there's not like leading to, uh, to 404 pages or something like that. You also need to give it time, as I said. So it takes a while for Google to see these redirects and understand, OK, it's over there. Even if the new thing is, is already indexed, it might take a while until it starts serving, and we actually switch over uh, the canonical to the new site. So that takes a while. Um, and eventually, you can generally just phase out the old domain. I would not like push too fast for this. So there's like a lot of nuance and detail here that you will find in the documentation. And if you look around on the internet, there's plenty of amazing people who have given presentations on this topic and who build tools for this kind of situation. Um, so it's not an easy thing to do, and I definitely recommend uh, like going with someone who has done one beforehand and like trying to figure out if they can help you make sure nothing gets lost uh, is probably a good idea. And uh, definitely check out our documentation on developers.google.com slash search for more on this topic. Thanks a lot for the fantastic question, and I hope that all of you keep submitting questions in the form below. Uh, please leave us a comment if you like the new format. Um, if you would like to, to do like longer versions or shorter versions, um, if the audio is fine, you know, these kind of things. And uh, leave us a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for your time, and have a great day. Goodbye.